it's very important to know that tokenization can be done both on the private blockchains or on the public blockchains. And we at Stobox, we focus on tokenizing assets or RWAs on the public blockchains. And when you tokenize an asset, there's certain token standards that have to be implemented. And we at Stobox, again, work with what is called Ethereum Virtual Machine compatible standards, which basically allow us to create any type of logic, right? We can take any type of business, understand what would be the asset that has to be tokenized and tokenize it in compliance with all the rules and regulations and utilize existing standards like ERC-20, ERC-721, ERC-1400. There's a number of standards that we utilize in order to move the asset from the traditional ledgers to the blockchain-based ledgers. Tokenization can be done on different blockchains. It can be done on the private blockchains or it can be done on the public blockchains. And it's not only Ethereum, right, where you can tokenize your assets or where you can find RWAs or security tokens. There's also ledgers like Ripple, like Bitcoin, like Solana, that are now introducing their own methods of tokenization and their own methods of permission chains or permission mechanism that would allow security tokens to be on that chains and which allow tokenization on that specific chains. But again, we at Stobox focus mostly on EVM compatible chains like Ethereum. Okay, so when you as a business would like to tokenize your business, right, you have to understand what type of, uh, what type of procedures and what type of activities you have to perform, right? So before you start, you have to understand that tokenization is the process. It's not just something you install, right? It's not something that you can easily download or you can easily adopt. That's a process of transferring your existing corporate securities or never existing corporate securities to chain. And very important aspect is the technology that would allow you to do so. And when, you, when I say technology, it's actually the platform that is being utilized for that tokenization. And we at Starbox, we have uh, worked for almost five years in this market, in RWA, we were one of the first ones, one of the first companies that actually started to discover the opportunities of the real world assets or security tokens. And we have built our own platform and we have built actually three products, uh, fully decentralized products for RWAs and for security tokens. And the first product is the DS dashboard, right? DS dashboard V3. I will tell you more about what we're working on, but today we're utilizing V3 as a platform. It's a SaaS platform, which means it's a software as a service platform that actually allow business to run their tokenization assets. So we, in Stobox, we provide businesses with the tools to tokenize their assets. And one of the tools would be the platform for primary issuance of security tokens or primary issues of tokenized assets. And when we talk about the platform, what the platform consists of, it consists of an investor portal. So that's a place, that's a software where your investors, where you as an investor potentially can buy, sell, trade, manage your investments within a certain company, right? And again, for the business, it's the tool, it's the software for managing their investors. So there's investor portal for, for investors and there's a corporate or ash, asset issuer portal. So there's a software of, consists of two, two sides, right? Two screens. One is the investor side and the second is the corporate side. Of course, in our platform, we have a token management system tool for tokens that can be minted, they can be replaced, they can be burned. Everything can be done, all the operations can be done with security tokens or with tokenized assets within Starbucks 
products, right? So within our platform, there's a token holder management system. You can pay dividends. You can distribute different types of tokens. You can create a voting mechanism. So all the processes, all the things that you can do in your business, right? All these actions can be put on chain and now every single activity will have its log, right? Will have its transaction written in the history of the blockchain, which I just want to remind you, which is purely immutable. Blockchains are immutable. Most blockchains are immutable because that's you have to research what a blockchain is. It's a big database that allows all the transactions to be safely stored and never altered in the future. So this is an ultimate history book of your business assets. And this is exactly what we do at Stobox. We transfer your traditional assets onto the blockchain. And again, uh, platform or DS dashboard, it's only one product that helps our clients to tokenize their businesses, as well as it helps the investors to actually log in, to buy, to subscribe, to mint, to trade, and so on and so forth.